Philly children, Philly, what's up, man? USCJ here with some breaking news, with some big time news. USC gets a commitment from Akili Arnold. Look, he is the brother of Easton Arnold, and it's straight up go time with both of these kids, man. Both of these guys, they are big time players, players that right now are right now contributors. We know that there's gonna be an open competition, but look, man, you're talking about guys that have this type of experience that come from. Oregon State and you're going to see some highlights and that come from a defense that you guys already seen was proven um, built from the ground up and uh, these guys have great great ability man both of these guys um, were not what we call I guess you could say under underdog type guys but uh, Easton was actually rated higher than Akili. Akili came in as a three-star prospect and on the season um, he actually had a pretty decent season as well, just like his brother. Um, he had 62 tackles, 0 0.5 sacks, uh, half a sack, and then two INTs. And so total tackles this season, he had 62. Um, and the solo was 25. And of course, 37 assists. And he had the uh, one forced fumble. And so look, man, this guy is really, really... Just a productive guy. You you gonna see here in these clips. He's just a natural leader, man. You'll see how he leads the group. How he's always um, getting the group together, and he, how he's always out front. He's in everything that Oregon State did this season. And so look, now you're getting two guys that are absolutely major, major contributors. And I think with them, man, it's straight up go time, man. Both of them. Um, this one, uh, he is standing at. 5'11", 200 pounds. You guys know the British video I brought you already. His brother, that's him right there. He's 5'11", 228, 230 pounds. But now we're getting both guys that are like leaders, man. And Akili, even more so than his brother, is one of those guys. He seems like he gets all the groups, rally the troops together um, on the field and off the field. And that's what you want. You want a vocal leader in that locker room, somebody who takes the lead, somebody who takes the charge and can get the defense together and really, really get these guys motivated to play inspired football. And that's what I think we really see with a guy like Achilles, man. So I'm very, very impressed. And I noticed the trend that USC, that absolutely seem like they're getting, not only are they getting character guys, I noticed Achilles, um, after reading some information on his bio in Oregon State football, they had him up for a community award. He goes around in the community. You see him there leading the, leading the, uh, the troops right there. That's what he does. But um, they have him for, up for a community award, um, which he did a lot of work inside the community. And I think that speaks to the character. USC is absolutely getting character guys right now guys that fit the program guys that fit the scheme and guys that are going to be leaders that's out there in the front and uh making things happen but then making things happen on the field as well you see him here getting that pick of deontay moore uh so he's a leader on and off the field and what he's able to do um able to read coverages able to diagnose plays that's the kind of player you want and someone who's not as scared of contact either, man. So I think USC is getting a, a phenomenal player. I think they're getting a player that has great, great experience. And uh, it's straight up go time, man. Um, you guys can hit me in the comment section. How are you guys feeling? Where does the safety room look now? Um, you got a guy like Akili playing either the free or playing either the strong. We don't know. Whatever they decide to do. But I think USC just got themselves another ball player from Oregon State University. You guys remember, I told you, I said Oregon State is gonna be one of those schools that we that we can, once those guys hit the portal, we can absolutely go ahead and get some guys from Oregon State. And now USC made it official, um, got a couple of guys, and I think it's straight up go time, man. It's only popping, it's only cracking. Until later on, everybody stay blessed. Fight on, fight on, fight on.